Today on Opinionators, we came up with a few things we'd like you to see at home. We were brainstorming on the summer boring day, just got done mowing, and here's what we came up with. Dad, first you need to put a shirt on. Oh, crap. There we go. Dude, that's my shirt. Why are you wearing my shirt? Crap, I hate it when that happens. <sighs> now that's more like it, Dad. There we go. I hate it when that but doesn't work right. Shoes? Uh, you're right, I shouldn't probably better. wear these lawn shoes outside. Alright. Dad, I don't think flip-flops are the right thing either. Maybe a pair of tennis shoes? This is really becoming a hassle. Alright, fair enough. There we okay, go. Okay, that's more like it, Dad. Good job. Good. Flip -flops. flip flops. Yeah, I was probably going to stub a toe or something like that. Who freaking knows? First thing I need before we get started, I need a drink. I need something cold. Uh -huh. So, let me, uh, I want some... You know what? Hmm. I need something with sugar in it. Hmm. Hmm. Must be good. Yeah. Much better, dude. I need some sugar for today. Mm-hmm. All right, let's head outside. All right, our next segment we're going to show you is after I just got beat, I got to show some face here. So I'm going to show him a little trick that he may not be aware of. This currently has air in it. <laughs> Whoa. I'm going to drop this right here. And before it hits the ground, I'm going to have the atmosphere fill this up with water. Water. You believe I can do that? Yeah. Okay. All right, here we go, folks. It's impossible. Water, Dad, how did you do that? I told you, dude, it's from the atmosphere. The heck, dude? When you're dealing with the earth, we got wind, we got water, you gotta imagine it and it comes true. What the heck? How did you do that? Tell Simple. Me right now. Our next segment's gonna be what I like to call frisbee and football. How can you do both, you ask? Watch. Alright, I'm gonna throw this football, but this kid wants to catch a frisbee. So let's see if we can make it happen. Here it goes, folks. Wow, how did you do that? I told you it's magic, man. Anything can be possible if you put your mind to it. That's how you do it. Man, I don't know. I didn't think you'd be able to figure it out. It took me literally 10 years to get this trick. I, um, I it huh. well, let's see what else we got up our sleeve. All right, guys, our last stunt of the day because I'm really getting tired. Exhausted. It's 90 degrees out here. I'm going to do a, my highest vertical. Back in high school, 15, 16, 25 years ago, I've been known to touch the, the ceiling. I know people think that's nuts, but seriously, I touched the ceiling of the gym. Um, wasn't easy. So I'm going to jump up, I'm going to touch this branch right here, um, wish me luck, luck. all right? <laughs> Holy snap! Oh my oh. gosh, how did you, how did you jump up there? Dude, honest to God, oh. I did not mean to jump on the freaking tree branch. I was just, <laughs> Dude, uh. I thought you were not even going to reach it. So, oh. Get the freaking ladder, seriously, this uh, is freaking me out. We don't have a ladder. All right, guys. This is awkward. This is weird. Um, thanks for watching. This is Opinionators. And stay tuned next time. We'll come up with some new stunts for you.